So here it is, some of these hangover parts. Lots of Good morning, beautiful people. Hey, what's up, beautiful people? So here's another clip of me detangling my hair. I'm using an Aussie uh, Super Moisture Moisture Conditioner thing right here. And uh, a cup of water. I went ahead and cut a bottle of that to make some conditioner here to dip the hair in here. As I'm getting started and keeping some conditioner close as I detangle it. That being said, I'll catch you guys. My hair, uh, yeah, I had kind of told you guys a little bit last time as of, as of why I was doing it to start. Like I said, I feel like I'm in a good spiritual space right now where I need some change up and I'm feeling confident that this is the move um, for me and my life right now um, it has nothing to do with real estate and that industry because I've been doing perfectly fine meeting people this and the other with my hair it's not been a problem at all if anything it's definitely helped out but uh, me personally I think it's just time for a change and I know my hair is very iconic and a lot of people gonna be upset about it but um, who cares it's my hair do what I want and uh you're gonna be seeing a lot of new different styles and like that coming coming real soon folks so stay tuned and i just want you guys to know that this is a personal decision and i will definitely come back to get some locks not a lie this is not a forever goodbye i can tell you that for a fact because right now the plan is probably to go ahead detangle this grow this out some more and then start probably in more traditional set of locks. Uh, I'm not entirely sure just yet. Um, just depends on how I'm feeling whenever I get to that stage in my life. So it'll probably be like a year or two from now, which would be, you know, pretty much perfect. And I just felt like this right now was the move and just following my gut and my heart and sticking to it, sticking by it. I'm just gonna see what happens. So yeah, that being said, I love you guys. And I'm gonna catch you in the next clip. And the reason I'm recording and also like as I'm detangling my hair and stuff like that is because I want to give people that have way more matted hair the, the, the faith that they can do it because I was watching other videos and I've been going to all my friends and people like that are like, there's no way, this, that, and the other, you know, people will be doubtful. So I want to prove all this doubt is wrong. And so that's why I'm going to go ahead and knock this bad boy out. So I have my hair up currently and I am taking this bad boy down. As you can see, the bad boy is being detangled as we speak. It's getting really close to being finished. So I've been using um, this comb right here, just like this. Um, I've also been using a thumbtack as well for the metal teeth, and then this. And I mixed some of that into some water, like I said before. And I cut a cup and uh, put some conditioner in there and dip my hair in there every time. Every, uh, probably like every five minutes. And I moisturize this through my lock a little bit as I'm doing it so that way I can detangle it. And as you can see, we got a twist here, some right there. Um, there's another one back there. Actually, no, that's just regular dread. There's another one back here. That's a twist. And uh, we're just knocking it down bit by bit. The next part is going to be the back. And y'all, that's going to be the crazy part right there. So that's gonna be a mess, but we're gonna see how good I can do with it. All right, with that being said, now we have a fully detangled lock on my hair. And yeah. All right, so now I decided to work on the uh, the neck, the other side. So pretty much I have this one left right here to knock out, as well as this bad boy over here. And then these will be all twisted up. And then this would just be these two back here to do on this side to finish up. Um, and then we're gonna really get started on the back, as you can see. Oh, I'm gonna miss that brown, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. As you can see, we're gonna get the brown knocked out as well as this, this craziness up top. I'll show you a little bit better. Yeah, so you can see my crowns have all folded in on each other. So it makes it really like challenging to like and get started on it but what i think i might do is grab some scissors and just trim just the very edge of it because you see how it's like rounded there i'm probably just gonna grab some scissors just to chop up the edge just a tiny bit just so i can get to the actual hair but of course i'm gonna record that let you guys know let you guys see it but so far so good i'm really enjoying the process even though it's kind of tedious you know, i just put on some good netflix watching some love island which is a great show for you guys if you guys are looking for something fun to watch um i definitely would recommend that but uh yeah so right now i'm continuing on to this to try to finish knocking this bad boy out and uh 
you know, put this one behind me. I definitely love this one a lot. I guess I didn't give it that much credit while I've had it, but I definitely truly do like it. And we're gonna turn this into probably like two or three twists because there's so much hair locked up in here. Um, let me show you guys what the hair is looking like so far. So this is like my, one of my little, little spots or whatever with all my hair and whatnot. But yeah, so I'm gonna continue this uh, more a little bit. My man's Prosper is here. Prosper's here, by the way. Oh, y'all like that, don't y'all? So yeah, I'm just continue detangling the hair. Stay tuned for the next you clip. Do what you gotta do because that's what you're supposed to do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna catch you on the next clip. So now I have my friend Alex helping me to tangle more of my hair. This is where we are so far. Working on this thick one back here. And yeah, it's going pretty well. All the rest of these are twists. I'm keeping these three up here. But everything else is twists. So those are three, two. Um, now I have finished a very thick one back here. I'm gonna throw a picture up on the screen right now of what it looked like, but this is the big chunk I have. So my entire left side is done now. So this is what we're looking like. All the sides and the back is done right now. Um, the back, the actual back has to be done as well as the sides and the top up here. So we'll be getting started on that very, very soon. I'm pretty proud of what's coming out right now. These are the twists. And then I went ahead and made the twist on this side, but I decided to go ahead and like detangle them or whatever. So this is what it's looking like right now. So I'm pretty excited to see uh, what everything will look like once it's all said and done. So with that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next clip. Every time you guys see me, it's something new and it's something better. So let's go ahead and make sure to make this whole shake. All right, y'all. Catch you later. All right, guys. So now we have twisted the entire head. Well, actually not the entire head, just all my sides. And so uh, when I take them all out, it's gonna look great. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and knock out the back and the top now. And we're gonna make sure we're popping and we're gonna flick. I'm gonna put them all in a twist and we detangle them and then we're gonna see what's going, what's going. Love you guys, catch you soon. Pretty much most of the hair that I've lost, I've um, been keeping in this bag. This All right, so this is the back of my head right now before I really get cracking on it. Um, I'll show you guys the after and I'll also show you some of the process too. Oh, shoot, and here's the top. Ooh wee, we're gonna have some problems up there. So we're getting started on the back. As you can see, the soft parts right there. It's gonna be tough for sure, but I'm gonna make it happen some way, one way or another. So yeah, let's see how this goes. So in terms of my hair right now, I told you guys to start working on the back. Uh, I'm trying to detach the main chunk from this other main chunk. And so what I, what I just happened is the back of my hair is heavy and it dropped right here. I have not been able to move this individual chunk because it all grew together in at least three years. So there's a shake for y'all. Crazy, man. I'm really learning about a lot about myself and whatnot in this process right now and uh, it's going to take a lot of patience and term determination to finish it out and i'm excited to see where it all goes so we're gonna see how this continues i love you guys i know this video is all choppy and whatnot right now but i've been doing this over the last um last four days i've been working on my hair for the last four days so this has just been what i've been progressing through um as i've been going on so with that being said i love you all and we're gonna see how to when I, when I when I finish this part up or as I really crack into it because right now right now all the space right here used to be connected so it was like this it was basically like this so I've been able to weasel it and wiggle it until it became its own separate section now I just gotta separate it even more down to a root and then I can go ahead and start getting really started on this bad boy back here so let's see how this goes guys
so I'm back and this is what we're at with this now. As you can see, it's actually starting to get somewhere. Um, from the last clip, I think I'm going to show you all this is actually a lot more progress. I can actually grow my hair through a couple inches with this. So hopefully soon I can work through the rest of this down to the root. And once I'm at the root, this will be all gone. I'm trying to finish it up by tomorrow morning or yeah, sometime tomorrow on Saturday yet again. Let's go we can do that. We're going to sleep right now. Okay, you guys. Later. Right, so the back has been split into two separate chunks. Finally, um, this is what it's looking like right there. Boom. Boom. So I'm just gonna finish detangling this part. Doubts have disappeared under street lights. Couldn't give a single fuck about those hard times. It's just delirium. I finished the back of my hair. It took me three days to do so. I'll show you guys in a second. Uh, right now, here are all my twists for the sides that I just took out because I'm going to go ahead and wash my hair, um, shampoo, condition it, paint all out, and then re twist them up. Uh, in the meantime, as I can finish on the top. So. Here is the back. And here's the twist from the section, the, the set bottom section that I originally had did first. But yeah, let's see how this all goes and I'll get you guys right after the shower. As promised, fresh out the shower. Um, so this is just the, the sides in the back. Um, there's a lot more length in there. It's just I have extreme streakage. I have a 4C hair texture, so it makes it really hard for me to, you know, for one, get through my hair, but to showcase my actual length. Um, but here's the back. And then, uh, let's see what I can do lengthwise. Let's see, grab a decent stretch of hair and show you what's up. twist them out and then uh later the next clip you guys are going to see is me starting the monster so game plan with this is to split it up into three sections and it's time to reach section day by day until it's finished so hopefully that goes well so we'll see and i'll get back to you guys and uh these are just some temporary twists i put in to protect the hairstyle right now as um i'm waiting for to finish up here and have my mom do some other stuff with it but uh, here's the whole whole look Look at this craziness. This is all I have left. Here's like a little preview, I guess. But obviously, it's gonna be crazy because this part's gonna drop too, and all this hair is gonna be playable. But look at that. Low key, a look. And I would totally rock this if I was, you know, restarting free forms and something like this happened. I'd rock the heck out of it. But yeah, um, that's where we are. Guys, I finished. It is finally done. Everything's in twist right now. I said I'll wash it. I'm gonna wash it and just don't want to retwist it. But it's all done right now. Oh, brother, I can't believe I actually, I actually did it. Um, but yeah, just put all that just to finish what I just did right now. So that was pretty crazy. But hey, I'm like how it is right now. I'm gonna take him out the twist in a little bit and then we'll see. So I just took all these twists out, uh, picked out the roots, put some oil in there, um, and this how we looking. You can do it, mean. Uh -huh.